this is the modern periodic table the present accepted form of the periodic table which includes 118 elements well don't worry right now we'll deal with only this part of the periodic table that is the elements belonging to group a 1a 2a 3a 2a a so we know that the vertical columns are known as groups let's see if the elements belonging to any particular group follow any trend so let's see the elements belonging to group 1a these are the group 1a elements hydrogen its electronic configuration is 1 lithium its electronic configuration is 2 1 potassium it's 2 8 8 1 and so on do you see any change the first element has one shell the second element lithium has two shells the third element sodium has three shells four shells and so on also if you will observe these elements belong to group 1a and if you will see each element has one valence electron so the group 1a elements have one valence shell electron in each case let's see the elements belonging to group 2a beryllium has electronic configuration 22 magnesium 282 and so on so do we see the same change here these are group 2a elements the number of shells increases one by one and the valence shell has two electrons each okay so now let's see the group 7a elements these are the group 7a elements fluorine the first element has electronic configuration 27 chlorine has 287 so the group 7a elements have seven electrons each in the valence shell so here we saw a particular trend a trend that the group number is equal to number of valence electrons in each case so for all the elements in the periodic table the elements belonging to a particular group they have equal number of valence electrons also the further trends in the elements belonging to a particular group we saw that the number of shells increase progressively that is one by one so the first element has one shell second element two shells and so on we also saw that this, they have the same number of valence electrons the group 1a elements have all the elements in group 1a have one valence electron the group 2a elements all of them have two valence electrons and so on they have the same valency valency is the number of electrons lost shared or gained to complete the octet in the valence shell since these elements have the same number of valence electrons therefore they have the same valency they have the same chemical properties we know that the chemical properties depend on the electrons that are present in the valence shell elements belonging to a particular group they have the same number of valence electrons therefore they have the same chemical properties what is the number of valence electrons of elements that belong to group 5a we have seen that in each group the group number is equal to the number of valence electrons so the elements that belong to group 5a each of these elements have five valence electrons so all the elements that belong to group 5a have five valence electrons so this is the trend that is followed by each of the each element that is present in a particular group